thank you guys so much. We are Silver Gun and Spleen from Ottawa, and we're so glad to be here for this event tonight. Rock for a dream. I, I do hope that when like younger girls see our band think like oh maybe I can do it too because I like I remember growing up thinking that I would never be able to do like to be in a band or to learn how to play music to learn an instrument or to learn how to write you know I think that sometimes we're not taken as seriously and um, it's funny because I just noticed recently because somebody brought it up and um, I really realized it I think because we're girls a lot of times they just assume you're singers right away and you know, like, yes, I do sing, but I can play instruments, too. And she's mainly a guitar player. She's not really a singer. She does backup vocals, but she's the guitar player. A lot of times they think it's pop. Oh, you guys are in a nice little pop band. Oh, you play keyboard? You know, usually when I say I'm a guitar player, what, you're a guitar player? You play guitar? That's crazy. You're a girl? You play guitar. Yeah. Yeah, you're so. a girl. In the rock business, there's a lot more men and I feel that they should set an example. Actually, I know that automatically a lot of people just assume that the guys are dating us. Like, sex shouldn't always be a topic of discussion. Sometimes it's the first thing that comes out of their mouths before even introducing themselves, you know? Like, hey baby, like, that's not how you say hi to a girl. Like, you shouldn't be, you know, just don't be a pig. Just. You know, talk to them like you would talk to another person, to another guy, to a, your daughter, to, you know... Your mother. Yeah. <laughs> I would also say to not assume anything, because your girl doesn't mean that you do certain things or that you don't do certain things. Talk to the person just as you would a guy, in a sense, like... Going online about, like, rape culture and stuff like that, and... I, I don't even know what to say. It's. It's disgusting. That's. I don't even. I don't even understand how there could be that many people that would think that that's okay, or even okay to joke about, or it. Sh it, it should even be like a topic of discussion. Like that's. I don't even know what to say. That's horrible. I think it's really important to to let girls know that they can they can rock out and they can do whatever they want to do makes it stronger, you know, makes the word stronger that girls can go out there and do whatever they want. I think that Ride for Dream is an amazing cause. Uh, I think that what everyone is doing is really fantastic to raise awareness. It's, it's really, really great and I, I would like to support it in any way that I can. There aren't many causes out there that's there to raise awareness for, to end violence against women, so I think it's really amazing. And we'll support it any way that we can.